Hello healers! Thanks for clicking in this video. Welcome. If you're new, welcome back. If you're not the new and you're here supporting me, thanks very much for being here with me. This is going to be a pick an angel uh, reading, alright? I had a feeling to do this one regarding any questions, any need of guidance that you may be in need at the moment. This is really for you to ask a question that you need an answer from the higher powers, the above. So that's why I have the angels here. So I just want you to ask your question. This is not a yes or no. This is really a guidance of what you need to hear right now, what your angels have, you know, the higher powers have uh, to tell you at this moment. So any guidance, any need of help that you need at the moment, ask your question or even if you don't have any question if you just need any guidance you know just concentrate on the pile this is going to be you see the angels here and this is going to be group number one two and three like i always say the details of the cards i use and my details if you want any uh, private reading or any information will be on the description below go with your gut feeling your first choice is most likely the right one but of course you can watch the whole video if you want so concentrate on what you need to hear right now from your guides the higher power or if you do have a question ask it and this is really a guidance for what you need right now or the question you need to answer right now in your life if you need a guidance okay again concentrate group number one two and three thanks very much for watching subscribe and leave a comment if you it resonates with you i will be really happy to hear from you all right thanks very much if you are in a group number one and you chose this beautiful see true angel i did see here to help us out as well these are your cards right you have uh, crown chakra i will read all the messages for you Release, expectation, cycles, new beginnings, trust, positive future, and love. Beautiful cards here. If you have a question or if you just need a guidance, I feel straight away this is really about releasing a pain or any hard situation that happened to you in your past whether it's with a family or with someone in your life it's about uh, clearing yourself all right and being able to open for a more positive future what i see here with the crown chakra the message pay attention to your ideas as they are messages of true divine guidance sent in answer to your prayers so I feel like you're already praying and asking for help from above with this uh, you need right now release is work with Archangel Michael to let go of what no longer serve you and your purpose this is what I'm saying about things that you may need to release from your past or hard situations you have been uh, gone through and it happens really this is life things are going up and down many times and it could be like i say in different areas of your life but i feel like it's the cards are really telling you it's time to let go and the cycles here really goes together with that the cycles are saying we are all becoming surrender to your changes release your fear trust this powerful process see you could be on the process of growing you know we are always things are happening for, for a reason in our lives and this the cycles here it's really clear about situations that you could be going through it could be hard at the moment and you trying to understand why something happened to you why me you could be asking things like that but it's really about re understanding is a process sometimes of growing that we have to go through and this actually goes together with the trust card here as well so trust that there is a reason for things to be happening in your life at the moment there is a reason for any situation that is happening with you and be 
you see here open for the new beginnings you see the expectation card is here be open for whatever comes next it might just be the music your heart's been waiting to hear i feel like this is coming here to tell you this will end this is a cycle that is ending you just need it to release take out anything that no longer serve you places people you know situations that you are going through at the moment you may have to step away and take some people out of your life or some situation or attitudes out of your life and trust you know trust that you are in a cycle in a process of growing and you go through ups and downs sometimes but there is a light you see at the end of the tunnel there is a new beginning card here for you really clearly clear telling you 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 can expect the best you see there is you know there is a reason for this there is an, an open door it could be just what your heart is waiting for you know so don't give up and it's really about you see here the positive future card is here as well telling you it's just a cycle this process the time of your life right now and love you know this love is here to remind us to love ourselves and to love others like to to be treating others the other way you want to be treated and to love ourselves first sometimes we do need to make hard decisions and regarding taking away some people from our lives or situations but that is just part of the process of growing and understanding that something or some some people or some attitudes like i said no longer serve you it's really clear here as well ask the above the higher powers to help you sometimes maybe just understanding where that situation is if it's not very clear for you at the moment but you're just feeling the pain but i feel like you do know what the, you know the situation you need guidance the message here is for you to understand this is a process all right so release what no longer serve you you are in a process right now but trust trust and do expect you know the new beginning is here for you and it's a positive beginning it's a positive future here for you with this card being very very clear here and just make sure you're treating yourself well you're treating the others around you because sometimes when we're hurting we we hurt others as well hurt people hurt people you know you always uh, hear that and it's true so love yourself take care of yourself take time to heal and release this pain the situation that happened to you just understanding looking back with loving eyes to yourself with forgiveness to yourself to begin with and then others because sometimes we blame ourselves for situations as well and it's really the process is not about that the process is about looking back and understanding why something happened how you can become a better person how you can move on and choose different uh, situations different people different attitudes that will bring you to a more positive future and the new beginning positive future love expectation all these lovely cards are here to show you that this is just a, a process this is just about to change so you're really close to changing i feel like you've been through the hurt already the worst has already gone it's just a matter of releasing and seeing what else no longer serve you and going ending this cycle and moving on to the positive future you can expect this you know it's what your heart's been waiting for it's really clear so the angels the higher powers are here to tell you it what you expected uh, you know expect what you wanted what your heart is waiting for it, to release everything and be able to move on it's really close so just trust trust on the higher powers ask for help meditate take your time take time for yourself and you're really close to release and moving on from this this cycle of your life at the moment and we do have to look back at patterns and things that we have done in the past that brought us to this situation and it's really about recognizing them and moving on from the same patterns that didn't bring us to a good place to begin with so not repeating them and learning understanding being able to move on so i just hope you re you understand that it's a process but to look back with loving eyes to yourself and others and be able to make better choices 
but there is a positive future here waiting for you it's really the cards are really positive showing you just trust trust in a, it's a process all right that we have to go through from time to time i hope it resonated with you group number one these are beautiful cards here i feel like there's some hurt to be work on but you're really close to this positive future the love it's waiting for you new beginning new beginning is here so it's really close all right so trust in the process release and ask the higher powers for help as well okay i hope it resonated if it did leave me a message i will be really happy to hear from you thanks very much for being with me group number one thank you group number two if you chose this beautiful lilac purple angel i'll leave it here to help us out you know what your question is you know what kind of guidance you need or you may just need a guidance right now here are your cards heal away addiction clear yourself anticipation integrity surrender and release blessings seasons of the heart abundance from within beautiful cards here straight away group number two i feel like with this heal away addictions there is something that you may need to work on to heal yourself and clear from your life it doesn't mean addictions it could be for some of you but it could be some kind of addiction in a way social media or some groups that of people that you may need to move on for, from the message here is it's time to let go of behaviors that are blocking you from your heart's desire ask archangel Raphael to help you with this healing so it's really about like i say it could be really uh, real addictions anything that you need to take away from your life doesn't help in your body or growth or mind at all it is not something that is helpful or it could be something that's addictive could be a relationship that's addictive a friendship that's addictive you know you know what it is you know if it resonates with you it's really time to clear something from your life again another one here clear yourself ask the angels to release and uh, any toxic energies that you may have absorbed so it doesn't mean that you did uh, consume something specifically but it could be that uh, you you are absorbing these toxic energies from around other people it could be a bad work environment as well like i say it could be people could be addictions like specifically for some of you but i feel like in many cases just where you are at the moment the circle of people you are mixing with yourself with and you're taking away maybe you're not doing anything but you are in a group of with a group of people that are doing wrong things or something that is really not resonating with you or you did and you're still carrying that energy of something that happened so it's really about clearing yourself both cards here really clear this one here surround and release so if it, there's any fears anything that you don't know how to do it surround to the higher powers ask for help and uh, it will be there for you you know if you need the specific steps of what to do ask for directions ask the higher powers to send you people to help you out as well and anticipation card is here something wonderful is happening change is in the air open yourself to blessings on the way so it's really about opening yourself don't um don't stay stuck in this energy this bad energy these things that are going on at the moment so it's time to heal it's time to cut away people places situations that no longer serve you and not bringing you anywhere this is quite direct here an integrity card is here drop the things that offend your soul embrace your truth it's it's your life let no one leave it for you another message very clear connected here with this other two telling you what what is your real truth you know it, are you doing things that 
are hurting yourself, your soul, your integrity. Things that really don't serve you at all. I feel like it's around you. Like I say, situations, people. It could be a relationship. It could be a job. It could. You know what it is. There's, it is time to clear yourself. It's really emphasizing here in a few different ones. And it's even the seasons of the heart is here telling you that we go through to this situation sometimes to learn. You know the. You know, we have all willpower and they, the choices are there. And sometimes we, we just end up doing something that we don't want to or being with people we don't want to. But it, it is time to understand, you know, your heart and understand why something happened and let go of that and allow yourself to surrender, release to the higher powers, clear yourself, your mind, your body in, in some cases and allow the blessings, the anticipation of the good things that will come, it's here. Abundance from within. It's really about you being able to re release and listen to yourself and understand that you have so much potential, so much power, so much inside of yourself to heal yourself to begin with and to help others as well. You know, if we're going through some difficult situations, we can just learn with that and you would be able to help others that have gone to the same similar situations that we did i feel like you you were able to help others once you move away from the, the the state that you are now it's really about clear yourself take care of yourself right now physically emotionally if you have to you know ask the higher powers to help you out to move from the group of people of whom to move from this relationship or from this job that is not helping you is bringing you down so look around you know make a hard decision if you have to if you know that you're being true to yourself you know drop the things that offended your soul you know think back of things that are happening that you really are not happy you don't want them in your life so surrender and release to the higher powers the blessings are, are coming. You do, you do have so much potential from inside yourself and so much power. So believe in yourself as well. Understand that you can do it. You can move on. You have the power. You have the ways. And if you don't know, if you're confused or what are the next steps, ask the higher powers. They can really guide you to look around with different eyes from outside sometimes we needed to like step out and see how the situation is going so far is it bringing you anywhere is it helping you at all and if it's not is it time to let go how you do that you know the higher powers are here to help you and like i say i always say start start taking some time for yourself five minutes of meditation you know just five minutes when you have in your shower to yourself, to meditate, to think, to analyze and really make that hard decision if you have to. This, I feel like it's really a time, time to clear body, mind and really be able to release and be true to yourself and make sure you're not doing anything that you're going to regret, you're going to be really unhappy with. And even if you did already, it's time to release, it's time to forgive yourself and move on. Because you have so much abundance from within, you have so much potential, you have so much to give, and the the big the blessings are there for you. So you know something wonderful is hap is, is 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 happening. Change is in the air, so it's so close to you. Once you start taking care of yourself, you can reach and you can realize it's so much closer than you than you can imagine. You know. So I hope this resonated with. Uh, some of you or you know do leave me a comment if you need help if you need more details I do private readings I feel like you may need m more help or more details don't be afraid to reach out you know look around who are your true friends be true to yourself who maybe need to go back to your family it you know what the situation is about so just make sure you're true to yourself, you take care of yourself and the blessings. There's so much, you know, potential and so many good things close, cl very close to you. 
change is in the air. You know, open your, uh, open yourself to the blessing on on their way. So when you, I feel like you'll be closed at the moment. You can open yourself. You can heal yourself. You can clear. You can move away from the situations, and be really happy. So I hope it resonated with some of you. And if it did, please leave your message. I'll be really happy to hear from you. Thanks very much, group number two. Group number three, if you chose this beautiful pink angel, we leave it here to help us out. You'll know if you have a question or if you just need a guidance. Those are your, your cards, all right? So heart chakra, I'm going to read all of them for you in a bit. Throat chakra, interesting. Awareness. Manifestation, Garden Angel, Dreams, Sea of Love, Intention. Lovely cards here for you. Group number three. I feel like you, if you have a question, it's really about anything to do with what should you say or what what is your answer for something you have like an answer something to to decide or if you just need the guidance this this here it is all right the heart chakra is here telling you the answer that you seek is in your heart right now be open to giving and receiving love interesting here is saying the answer because i feel like you do have a question group number three and the throat chakra here, the angels are helping you lovingly speak your truth. So straight away, the guardian angels are here as well, showing here in this card. It's really about something that you already know in your heart what it is, but you're still fighting hard to make a decision. And uh, the angels are telling you straight away, be true to yourself. What do you really want? You know, that's how you're able to to make the decision to, to, you know, be able to speak up properly. And Garden Angels, it's here to remind you, you have the higher power, you have protection around you, the angels, the however you want to call, right? The creation, the above, the higher powers are around you to protect you, to guide you. In case you didn't have a question, this, these cards are here telling you what do you want what do you really want be a, you you should be able to speak your truth you should be able to really decide and do things according to your dreams to what you want the dream card is here as well are they sending you any guides through your dreams as well do you do you have any vivid dreams lately anything that it's sending you a message from above and also a reminder for you to think, what are your dreams? What do you still want that you didn't do, but you, you have that feeling of something you want to do, but you're not allowing yourself, or you didn't have the courage to do yet? The awareness card is here telling you, pay attention to the subtleties. Look with new eyes. There are signs and omens everywhere. Interesting here with the dreams with this card and the dreams so pay attention to your dreams pay attention to the small details of things that bring you happiness i feel like in case you don't know what to do in case you don't know how to make a decision right now it's really about what do you want what are the things you like what pay attention to the the few things during the day during the week or looking back a few months what did bring you joy you know what were the few things that you can pay attention and look back and, and remember you are happy about it or you happy about doing and manifestation card is here a very powerful card your dreams have an untold energy open the door and let them leave desire and believe are your power really really showing you here that again Paying attention to your dreams, what you 
what you want, the things you want to do. The manifestation is really big, is showing that you can do anything you want. The power is in your hand. Intention card is here as well, and Sea of Love, showing you that what you want, what you put your intention into, you can manifest. Sea of Love is for you to remember, use love towards yourself to begin with, to understand yourself, to understand your desires, what you really want, what speaking the, the truth to others and first of all being true to yourself. Use this love towards you, first of all, and it will pour into everybody else around you. Use love, intention, manifestation. The, the cards are really straight and Beautiful here, showing you, you can do what you want. It's just a matter of paying attention for to what you really want. Don't do what other people want. Don't leave other people guide you and push you into anything that you're not happy with. Ask, like I say, the high powers and in, in your guides are here to help you. But the throat chakra is here really clear telling you, you know, be true to yourself. Speak your truth. Don't leave anybody else push you because you are powerful. You can manifest anything you want. In case you're in doubt, remember, pay attention to the details. Pay attention to the details regarding any area that you could be in doubt or asking about right now. Are the people around you really helping you? Are they bringing you joy? Is this job or is this relationship bringing you joy? Pay attention to the details. What are the things that really don't resonate with you and you're allowing them to happen maybe because you're afraid to speak your truth, you're just accepting situations, other people. Just remember, you are powerful. You can manifest anything you want. Your dreams, pay attention to your dreams. You are worthy of your dreams. Doesn't matter, you know, how long it took you to you give the first step about your dream it's never too late never too late just make sure you are being true to yourself true to others and the the guide and the feeling is that you already know what to do or you already know some situation that you needed to to move towards it's just believing in yourself believing in your dreams having that confidence if you are missing anything, any confidence. If, you, if you're feeling that you're not powerful, you these cards are here to remind you that you can look at yourself with different eyes. You know the same situation. Look at yourself with new eyes. Your intentions, your dreams. You can manifest anything you want. Those cards are really beautiful and powerful. It's giving you power. It's telling you you have the power to change. You have the power to manifest your dreams. Just to speak your truth. Just be true to yourself. Look within what do you really want. It's the main message here. Be true to yourself and ask that you have so much protection and guide and guidance around you. So don't be afraid of anything. You can do anything. These cards are really telling you here. You can manifest anything. Be true to yourself. That's all you need. Your dreams, your dreams can come to reality. All right? You know if it's a message or if it's a guide, a guide that you needed. But this is the message here for you. Okay? Group number three. I hope it resonated with you in some way. If it did, please leave me a message, a comment. I will be really happy to hear from you. But again, this is really about you believing in yourself because you can manifest anything once you're doing what you want, once you're true to yourself. You have so much protection around you. It's beautiful. It's beautiful to see here. Just use love towards yourself. Your dreams can be manifested. All the cards are here connected. And it's loving, loving to see. But I hope it did resonate with you in some way. And I will be really happy to hear from you if you did. Okay? Thanks very much, group number three, to be here with me until now. Thank you.